Good morning, everybody. Today is Monday morning. I did not get a chance to do any work this weekend. Uh, today is July 5th. Uh, Saturday, we went to Waco looking for houses and a shop. And yesterday, I was doing work at our current house. So we have quite a few. We have 38 orders right now. And what I'll probably do is split this video, the today's stuff, into three. That way I can put a video for Saturday, Sunday, and for Monday. And you won't end up with, you know, I think last time we had this many orders, it was like an hour and a half long video. So I'll probably use this intro for all three of them. But we have the packages, so let's get to it. Okay, I'm sure it's dark for you. We got a couple of video game adapters. Right here. These are the Wii Motion Plus adapters. Obviously the white ones. Uh, and I have two. Same buyer bought them both. We're going to ship these in an 864 box. Get a sheet of bubble wrap and cut it in half. Wrap each one up in half a sheet of bubble wrap. There we go. And I'll just put it right in like that. These, if they jostle around, won't get hurt. But there is still quite a bit of room. I might go ahead and put this little half sheet on top. And just to make it look better. There we go. And for these two uh, Motion Plus adapters, the buyer paid $14 with free first class shipping and they've been listed quite a while they were listed on june the 1st of 2016 and they'll ship at the eight ounce rate all right eight and now our next item a person well let me show you this one here first we have a postcard and it has been postmarked 1956 giant freighter leaving duluth superior harbor this sold for six dollars so all i'm going to do is put it in a postcard mailer and handwrite the addresses and put a stamp on it but i wanted you to be able to see the actual item and then we have a person that bought two model kits i'm pretty sure they fit in a 12 10 8 ebay branded box and these are two of the model kits they're in really rough shape the boxes I know I've fit new and sealed model kits in this before. So I think they'll fit in here without a problem, but we'll see. Alright, let's head into the garage. It'll be dark, I'll turn the light on, then it'll still be dark for you, but I'll be able to see. Alright, there we go. Now, like I said, it's going to be dark for you again. Alright, I think that one. Okay, so I had one of each. Alright, so the one in really bad shape is the Big Daddy Roth Mysterion. As you can see, that box is pretty crushed and everything. Both have been opened, 
And this one is a Gary Orms Bees Castrol Fuel Dragster. And this box is actually a nice shape. This is from a different collection. Let's see. Yeah, it's all still sealed in there. All right, let's get two sheets of bubble wrap and see if we can fit these in here. I think we just pull them both up like so. And I do want to tape these together right here pretty tight to hold them closed. There we go. Uh, I think we can just lay a sheet of bubble wrap here right on top. That works quite nicely. And this person paid for each of these individually, so I need to give them a little bit of a shipping refund back on the second one. And for the two model kits, they sell for $40.50 plus shipping. And the Mysterian was listed on June the 14th of this year, 2021. And the Dragster was listed, I'm not too sure, I forgot to write it. I thought these were from the same collection. But I think the Dragster was listed at the beginning of June of this year. So both of them, about 30, 40 days, and they're both sold. And they will ship at the pound 15 ounce rate. Now we have a buyer that bought two comic books. They're both the same issue, it's just different covers. And it is Asia Thoris number one. Make sure that's a fine to fine plus. And it is. And so is that one. or something in there yep. starting to tip all right let me get these bagged and boarded and i'll show you and so i can relist both of these or sell similar whichever you want to call it there we go. all right so we have the Deja Thoris issue number one the J Scott Campbell cover and then we also have the number one Frank Cho cover both really nice covers we'll put those into another bag there we go tape it shut and now we will get a Gemini mailer Tape it into place. And for these two Deja Thoris number one comics, the buyers total was seven dollars and 83 cents plus shipping and they were listed within just a day or two of each other but the oldest one was april 
the 18th of this year, 2021. And they will ship at the 12 ounce rate. All right, 12 on that. Now we have a Funko Pop. Oh, right there. This is a four pack from the Civil War movie. What you have is you have the Spider-Man and Hawkeye, the full-size pops, but then you have Captain America and Iron Man, the pop keychains. And this will go in a 12, 10, 8 eBay branded box. This is part of the uh, fellow who had a store here in town years ago. And I bought all his leftovers. And this is part of that. this up in two sheets of bubble wrap to start with. And again, I did list this with box defects, and if I remember correctly, this one, yeah, this corner here has like a, almost like a rip to it. And uh, I think another corner might have had a little, been crushed a little bit. So, I would think that this person's actually going to display these things, which would be nice. Alright, let's see if we need another two sheets. Or, no, we just need, uh, we'll get one sheet going across. And actually, what I might do is put the sheet folded up down here at the bottom. Give it some protection at the bottom. Now we'll do the sheet across. If it doesn't fall in first. There we go. And now just a sheet on top. That is about as well protected as we can do. Yeah. Yesterday I had the person in uh, Canada open an item not received case and it was a video game that was shipped through the eBay standard international rate way and it's supposed to be insured for a hundred bucks. You're covered for a hundred dollars and the tracking just showed where my local post office like when they came and picked it up they scanned it uh, and that's all it showed. And so today I called eBay to find out, you know, if I'd be covered or not, what I need to do. And she was able to look at other tracking and show that it has left here, and but it hasn't left the states yet. And that it's showing it'll be delivered, you know, in the next week or two. And she said, so she's going to notate the case and, you know, the buyer cannot escalate it or anything. So it looks as if right now I am covered. Now I responded to the buyer and let them know exactly what's going on. And so hopefully they'll get it in the next week or so. Uh, the four pack, Funko Pop four pack, sold for $33.75 plus shipping. It's been listed since June the 22nd of this year, 2021. And it will ship at the pound 15 ounce rate. All right, now we have this amazing Spider-Man number nine. This is the Rocket and Groot variant. It is published by Marvel and will ship in a Gemini mailer. And we will tape it down into place. This Amazing Spider-Man number 9 variant sold for $3.74 plus shipping. And it was listed on January the 19th of 2019. So it did take a little while to sell. And 
and it will ship at the 12 ounce rate and now we have an action figure that will go in a 12 by 6 by 6 eBay branded box bubble wrap I guess I'll put this up on the wall now and it is the Robin Hood figure from once upon a time the TV show uh, the box is badly damaged up here so I sold this as loose but complete Sits down in there nice and easy take another sheet of bubble wrap and fold it several times and I do like a U with it, so it holds it there in place. I guess it's more like a bridge, maybe. Alright, and the Robin Hood figure sold for $9 plus shipping. It's been listed since April the 28th of this year, 2021. And it's right at 12 ounces, so I'll send this the 15 ounce way. Okay, now we have a Xenoscope comic book, Robin Hood. Seventeen. right here needs to be a very fine and we need another one for photos because this is not on the white background that ebay likes so take this one yeah and send this one we'll photograph the other one let me get that bag and boarded There you go. This is the Robin Hood, the ongoing series, the first series, I believe. Uh, issue number 17, cover C. And this will ship in a Gemini mailer. And again, we just tape this into place so it doesn't move. I use painter's tape so it's easy to remove when the buyer gets it and it doesn't leave any sticky residue or rip the bag or anything. And the Robin Hood issue number 17 sold for $2.50 plus shipping. And it has been listed since April the 4th of 2017. And it will ship at the 12 ounce rate. And now we have a hat that we'll put in an 864 box. See, this is going to be a Jimmy Buffett hat on six, and it's a yellow hat. Right. Yep, that's it. So it's the Jimmy Buffett Tour 2014. This one's for you. It is adjustable, and the bill is bent a bit. I don't think it's bent enough necessarily to go in that way. So we'll just fold it up, put it in there. And the Jimmy Buffett hat sold for $15 plus shipping. And it has been listed 
since August the 15th of 2017 and will ship at the 8 ounce rate. Alright, now we got a few more comic orders to pull. The first one is Crypt of Dawn. Oh, there goes my pad. And we're getting journeys. see here we'll start with the journey we have issue 3 and issue 12 same buyer bought them both and I believe that bottom bag is too big we'll have to use a golden age bag instead of my normal bag I use for two comic books well might not be able to use that okay well then we'll go ahead and ship this in a Gemini mailer. And I don't know. I guess we'll tape them both down. Not sure how well this will work. I haven't done this before. tape the sides down because I think they could still slide around right now the bottom at least so we'll see if that works hopefully it does For the two journey comic books the buyer paid five dollars and eighty cents plus shipping and they were both listed on the same day june the 29th of 2019 and they will ship at the 12 ounce rate 12. all right now we have crypt of dawn issue number five a nice Lensner cover that will also ship in a Gemini mailer and this one we're used to I can take this one down very easily there we go And the Crypt of Dawn, number five, sold for $3.21 plus shipping. And this has just been listed since June the 11th of this year, 2021. So, it took less than a month for this one to sell. And it will ship at the 12 ounce rate as well. Alright, that is going to do it for today. And that should catch up the videos to where they're all on time now. I hope you all have a good night, and we'll see you again tomorrow for more packages. Bye-bye.